Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. Hi everyone, I'm Storm Shield meteorologist Brandon Woolley. Your current temperature now at 95 degrees. The dew point doing a little bit better for this afternoon, not by much at 69 degrees. Breezy conditions sustained now out of the south, upwards of about 18 miles per hour. Today we've seen those gusts between about 25 and 30. Luckily, less wind in the forecast overnight tonight. A clean sweep on live double Doppler 2 for early this evening and sunny skies over the city of Tulsa. But we could pull in a few isolated showers and some thunderstorms over the next two days, primarily in the afternoon hours and primarily over the higher terrain and throughout far eastern Oklahoma and northwestern Arkansas. Sand Springs now reporting 94 degrees. Those current temperatures elsewhere from the low to the mid 90s. Coffeeville at 94 degrees as well. 93 for our viewers in Bartlesville, about the same in Eufaula. 96 around Bristow and also Okima. When we factor in the relative humidity, that gives us the heat index. So now in Tulsa, it feels like 101 to our bodies and 103 in Coffeeville. Triple digit heat is in the forecast for the mid to latter parts of this coming work week. Gusty conditions now, as I mentioned, now in Tulsa, gusting up to around 25 miles per hour, stronger in Coffeeville, almost 30 miles per hour, and around 15 in Okima, 25 for our viewers in Okmulgee. The official daytime high today, folks, 95 degrees with that very mild low of 78, the record high way up there, 110 from 1936. Luckily, we're not going to be close to 110 for the next couple of days. Timing things out on future track clouds and precipitation for tomorrow on your Monday. Sunny skies in the morning, some increasing cumulus clouds by the afternoon. This one model solution is suggesting a few showers and some isolated thunderstorms far eastern Oklahoma, northwestern Arkansas, mainly over the higher terrain and about the same forecast will come about for Tuesday afternoon as well with some of those isolated thunderstorms. Storms. Overnight tonight, though, it's going to be really quiet out there. Clear skies, those overnight lows once again dropping off into the 70s. Pawhuska at 73 degrees, Sky took at 75. Southerly winds early in the evening between about 10 and 15. Some higher gusts from time to time, but decreasing that wind potential overnight tonight. Tahlequah falls off to 73 degrees, Stigler at 74. 75 for our viewers in McAllister with clear skies. Here's your day planner for tomorrow on your Monday. Toasty conditions for lunch. Sunny skies, 92 degrees, 97 at 5 with some puffy cumulus clouds as we saw in future track. Those daytime highs into the 90s, Vanita 96 degrees, lighter winds tomorrow out of the south between about 5 and 10 miles per hour. Muskogee comes in at 95 degrees, 1 degree warmer in Okmulgee. Southerly winds lighter tomorrow between about 5 and 10 miles per hour. Sunny skies in the morning, then some increasing cumulus clouds by the afternoon and some of those showers and storms very isolated in nature in throughout far eastern Oklahoma, mainly over the higher terrain. 99 degrees on Wednesday, mostly sunny skies. There you have it on Thursday, sunny and 100, 101 on Friday and those overnight lows anywhere from the upper 70s to the lower 80s.